Hey, what's going on, guys? So, uh, Mike DeBoard out as Tennessee's offensive coordinator. Who's in? Well, the, the popular talk here around town is Mark Helfrich, the former Iowa head coach, former Iowa offensive coordinator under Chip Kelly. Who do you want, Tennessee fans, as your next offensive coordinator? Do you want someone that's going to come in and kind of do like Mike DeBoard and run Butch Jones' offense but have their own little uh, spin on it? Or do you want someone that's going to come in and take full control of the offense and handle it themselves? question is, will Butch Jones allow that to happen? was looking at some statistics on Butch Jones on the Sunday morning sports talk show that I watch out of Knoxville. Uh, and it's pretty impressive. You know, uh, a lot of people don't like Butch Jones. They want to see him gone. I personally, uh, I love Butch Jones. I think he is the answer. I, I love to hear the man talk. Um, I love where our program is right now. I love everything about it. I love the trajectory of the program next year. You know, ne next year looks to be a similar kind of year as maybe a past year that we had here at Tennessee. And by that, I'm talking about going into the year, we had just lost a very prolific quarterback, as well as a lot of other stars. A lot of people, you know, they... They were expecting Tennessee to be good, but they weren't expecting huge things, and they definitely weren't. Nobody was talking national championship for Tennessee in 98. Nobody. So next year looks a lot like that for this Team 121 coming up. You know, for me, the big Butch Jones fan that I am, I can't wait till his next presser so I can hear him talk again. I get jazzed and excited when I know he's going to be doing an interview because I love all of the cliches. Um, I love to hear him talk about the chart that he uses to help coach in the games. And look, you know, I, I, I realize that I am a college football head coach who chooses not to work right now. You know, I, I could be out there... I could be the next Nick Saban if I wanted to. I just choose uh, to be disabled and to not be able to work. So that's where I'm at. What I'm, my point? My point here is I forgot what my point is. Damn it. Uh, so anyway, yeah, Butch Jones, the 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 next great college. Yeah, college quarterback. The next great college coach, damn it. Uh, it it's, it's just how it is, folks. Get used to it. Florida fans, uh, your jig is up. Alabama, we let you guys slip by with one more victory because p people like me knew that this was Lane Kiffin's last year. So, you know, being the big Lane Kiffin fan that I am, I wanted to see him get one more win over Tennessee before he leaves to take a head coaching job at FAU. Uh, but honestly, seriously, uh, who do you want as your next offensive coordinator at Tennessee, Tennessee fans? My personal choice, uh, it was mentioned earlier tonight uh, by a good friend of mine, Jim Bob Cooter, would be a great offensive coordinator at Tennessee. But is he going to leave the NFL to step down to the college ranks to coach. Why not? Lots of coaches do that, you know. He could step down a notch and get into coaching at the college ranks and work his way up to a head coaching job so he can go back to the NFL. Or he can stay where he's at and continue the trajectory that he's on right now. Anyway, that's it. Don't want this video to get too long. I'll be back with another video later today, possibly or tomorrow or next month or never. You just never know. Uh, hit that like button, subscribe, uh, what else, share, Twitterize this, Facebookalize it, um, because we're trying to get those numbers up here on the VVD channel, a 
selfless, shameless plug for the channel. Let's make this channel grow, folks. Help a brother out. Let's get me to 7,000 subscribers by the end of this month. I can do it. We can do it. You can do it. Isn't that right, boys and girls? Of course that's right. Go Vols. Where's the damn stop button? I can't see it.